Hello, this is Supercat1, and today I am playing Volts. It's a mod pack, which is really fun. Uh, I am using this seed. I will have it in the description. Uh, so let's start. Building the terrain. Still building the terrain. Finish building the terrain, please. There we go. Okay. So, uh, over there we look like we have some caves and stuff. Uh, first of all, we should obviously get a crafting table and all that stuff, so let's quickly do that. Just chop down this one tree. Uh, and I do have a couple of mods that I put in myself besides the ones that are in the vaults mod pack, so I will show those to you once I have finished jumping down the street. Okay, so obviously first of all we need crafting table. Place that down. Make some sticks. And make an axe. Now, because I have the tree capitator mod, which I put in, I can chop down this tree in one hit, which is very, very useful. So, cut down a couple more trees. Let's just make sure. There we go. Chop down some more trees. Now then, let's actually go to normal. There we go. I was messing with stuff earlier, so... Seeing how the ICBM stuff works, it's cool. It's a whole bunch of different missiles. Most of them basically destroy the entire world, so it's insane. But, uh, first of all, what should I make? Obviously we're going to need a pickaxe, so let's make that. There we go, we have a pickaxe. Let's take our crafting table with us. Over here to this area. Some cows over there, that's good. Now then, just get some cobble. Build a furnace. and make some charcoal. Oh! I am in cheat mode. Let's go to recipe mode. Delete one. Oh. Okay, well I'm just gonna throw one of those away. No, I only want to throw away one. Why are you throwing away the entire stack? Uh, okay, well... There we go. <laughs> that was odd. Anyway, we have a charcoal there. Let's make another charcoal. We need some torches. Make some more sticks. Okay, we have charcoal. Now we have some torches, that's good. I think I'm going to use this as a temporary base. So let's put torches around. Definitely put some torches up here, and around here, because this place looks... And I think that's even a creeper over there. So uh, let's just make sure nothing comes dropping down. There we go, we have some torches around so stuff shouldn't spawn. Should probably make a sword as well. Although I should probably collect some more cobble first. Because wooden sword does nothing. Need a cobblestone sword at least. There we go. Stone sword. Now, I don't see any sheep around. So it doesn't look like I'll be having a bed for a while. Which isn't great. Uh, let's get this coal. Coal is always good. Okay, let's replace this with the coal. Uh, why did it go up there? It goes there. Let's see. 
Uh, yeah. Should make a cobblestone pickaxe. Cobblestone pickaxe. There we go. It'll be a little bit before I actually <laughs> get into any of the cool stuff in volts, because you need all the different machines, and for that you need all the stuff. Let's go kill a couple of these cows. Get some beef. There we go. How much do I have? I have five raw beef. That should last a little bit. Some more cows there. I'll remember that. Now then, let's come back here. Set a waypoint so I remember. Home. Oh. Home. Now, obviously, I won't be living here forever, but for the first night, this should do. Okay. Uh, I only have one torch. Let's cook that. Get some cobble. To make another furnace. So I can make multiple things at the same time. I hear one of those stupid bats. I really hate those. I think that was one of the worst things that they could have put in. The bats, because they're so annoying and they don't even give you anything when you kill them, so... There we go, we have another furnace. Uh, okay, that should do for now. Actually, let's wait for that to be done, I guess. Uh, is it starting to get dark? Yes, in a little bit it will. Okay, there we go. We have all the steak now. Let's make... 15 charcoal. Then I can make some torches and go... Oh, there's an enderman! Oh my gosh! Whoa! That is a lot of mobs. Uh... Wow. Okay, I'm gonna need some armor before going down there, I guess. Wow. Wow. They're all trying to get up to me. Okay, well... <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh, let's wait till I have five. Come on. There we go. Oh, what? What am I doing? I have no idea what I am doing is the answer to that question. There we go. I have 21. I should probably put that. Eat some... Oh. What? Oh, <laughs> okay. Well, there's still a bit of light. I'm going to go out and kill some of the more of these cows. Where'd they go? They're all over here. Let's see if I can critical hit the next one. Nope. Nope. Okay. Well... Doesn't really matter. If you critical hit them, you can... If you do it while jumping and going down at just the right time, you can critical hit them and then you can kill them in one hit. But it's pretty hard to do. How much more do I have? I have 11 more. Uh, 13 more. That's good. And it's getting dark, so I need to go back. Okay. Here we are. We're back here in our little cave thing. Uh, charcoal. Good, good. There we go, make some more beef. And go to third person. So if I am attacked from behind, I can see it because of those stupid creepers that come up behind you. <laughs> hmm. Should probably try to wall this in, or at least try to make a little house right there. That would probably be smarter. Uh, I have enough wood. Yeah, 64 and a bit. Let's just get a start on that. Just gonna make a little shack. Start out. Not anything elaborate. Just a little shack. 
that I can hide from the creeper then. <laughs> now then, right here. Just create this. Now, right now, this is all boring and just the beginning basic stuff that you do every time you make a new world. But eventually, this is going to be really cool. Uh, torches. Here we go. Torches. Put the torches in. Put some torches. Finish the roof. Will I have enough to make a door? No, I will not have enough to make a door. Okay, that's... Yes, I do actually have enough to make a door. Let's hurry back here. Make a door. Okay, have a door now. Let's place the door. And... I will... Stop recording for now and keep recording once it's day. Okay, it's starting to turn day again here. Uh, really glad I didn't <laughs> stay the night over there because it's been completely overrun by skeletons during the night. Um, but anyway, during the night I went mining a bit. And down here found a couple of things along the way and it's like oh look a, a tin or oh look a copper right here was like oh look an iron and then I mined it and there's some more iron which is cool and then platinum which is relatively rare so oh more iron so this is a really good find is there any uh, more platinum wow and and more iron this is amazing don't normally find this amount of ores and there's some copper wow a lot of ores all in one tiny area let's put a torch here just to remember where I was ah, I'll get that later copper isn't really that important just use it for copper wire so let's go back up here Zombies breaking my door in. Get away! Stupid zombies breaking my door down. And that's a creeper right there. That's what that is. Let's not die because of the creeper. And I killed the creeper. And this is a skeleton, which I just killed instantly. That's awesome. Okay. We should move these things. So, first of all, just pick up furnaces, then pick up the crafting table. Bring them over to our little temporary house right here. Okay, crafting table, furnaces. Oh, there we go, that looks nice. Uh, we should open up this, make one here, home, okay, then open up this, and get rid of that one. And I should probably furnace up this iron ore. Why does it keep going into the top slot? That's just completely random. I need to go and cut down some more trees, so I will go and do that, because generally it's a good idea when you need to do something to do it. Now the first thing I'm planning on making is a sentry is from one of the Team Fortress mods, which I put in myself. Uh, it's not with the volts, 
but it's relatively easy to install it, so first I'll need a sentry base, which is four iron, that's relatively simple, and a sentry head, which is less simple, because that needs the dispenser, which will mean I'll need to kill some spiders, and also needs redstone, so that's not, and then just I'll need some rose red, which is really simple to get, because all you need to get that is a flower. But what's cool with the sentries is that, uh, well, just like in Team Fortress, they will shoot at any mobs that you tell them to. So you can just have one outside of your house and it'll defend you, which is cool. I can build the sentry thing right here, the sentry base, uh, without any trouble. Uh, let's make a chest, because that will be very useful. It's always good to have chests. Uh, where should I put the chest? I'll put it right here. I'll make a second one, too. So it'll be a double chest. There we go. Double chest. Let's put this right there. Okay, I'll make this. More redstone. And then I'll also need wrench. Which is four iron. And I could make that, but... That would be using up all of my iron, and I should probably make an iron pickaxe. There we go. Iron pickaxe. Very useful, because now I can actually get everything except for obsidian. Now, let's go see if any of these mobs have despawned. They probably haven't, because it's dark down there, but you know. can always hope. N what the heck? Oh, he's wearing glowstone armor. That also comes with volts. But that's just evil. A skeleton wearing complete glowstone armor. I really want to go down there because there's iron. There's so many mobs. Okay, let's go see if we can find another one of these caves. There's another one over this way. Or that way. Let's go to this one. This one, on the mini-map at least, looks less deadly. Although, right here, it looks pretty deadly. So... Torches... Ah! Lighting fixed. Let's place a torch. Mine, mine, mine the iron. I'm mining the iron. Mining, mining, mining. There we go, that's some more iron, that's very good. This is Manazit Ore. It's for the modular force field system, which I'm nowhere close to ever making anything from. And that's a zombie right there. Whoa, that's Ravine. Uh, hi zombie. Are you stuck? Aw, oh, okay. This is a lot of iron right here. This is good. What I could use more of is coal. But I haven't seen any of that. Yeah, that's a ravine. Okay. Let's come back up here. The cows. Should kill the cows. After eating. One thing which I really do like is with the mini map, you have the waypoints, so I will know where the home is without having to remember the exact direction. There we go, I got some more beef. Ooh, coal. Good. Clicked all this iron. <clears throat> there we go. What is farther in here? Absolutely nothing. Okay. <laughs> Let's go back to the home now. Uh, 
Well, that looks like a back way into that evil cave that's filled with mobs. Still haven't found any redstone. I need to find some redstone, but that's all the way down at the lava level. Smelt the iron. And that is all for now. So, yeah.